Hey, what up guys, J-Ho here and episode number five of the hardcore uh, challenge that we're going through. Uh, of course, all the rules are going to be down below, so make sure to check them if you have any questions about what any of the rules are uh, for the hardcore challenge if you're new to uh, seeing one of these. Uh, but we are in episode number five, the last episode, uh, we found an ultra medical key. Yeah, we did get picked up by two guys kind of spreading apart on me there. Um, but we found the ultra medical key. So we're probably just going to run, uh, interchange here, another run. Um, I do need to get elite players too. So we can, uh, do the trade to get the 133 shotgun and, uh, maybe I'll check out, uh, and see what we can upgrade in the hideout. See if there's anything there too. So, uh, cool. So make sure to subscribe so that way you're updated for future videos when they do come out as well and uh, smash that like button. Uh, it's a free way to show support and I definitely appreciate it. So uh, cool, let's go ahead and hop in. All right, so we have the ultra medical key. What do we want to do? We could, we could just pistol it. I don't really have much for ammo, but I might have much for ammo. Not entirely sure yet. Let's find out. Yeah, I mean, that's not bad. We can make that work. Yeah, let's just, uh, let's just try to do an ultra medical run really quick. All right, let's go ahead and hop in. Oh, I'm, I'm hurt. Okay, let me, I'm gonna have to heal. <laughs> let me heal up really quick. Do I have anything to heal? Shoot, I don't think I do. Hmm. Oh, actually, I'm gonna check the hideout. All right, so generator, boom. Security, boom. Probably all we can do. It's probably most of the money. Yeah, we need light bulbs and wires as much as we can possibly find. Stash would be nice to get an upgrade on. A drill, screws, WD-40s, and a bunch of money. Need one more relay. It's just, yeah, it's just rubles. Okay, so that'll be fine. That one's just rubles. I think this one's just rubles too. Cool, so we're good there. Water collector, hoses, yeah, usual stuff. Okay, cool. Well, let's go ahead and hop in. And we're just gonna have to go in like this, a little bit hurt. It'll be all right though. All right, so hopefully we get a good spawn and we can sprint right to Ultra Medical Room. That's the whole objective here. We want to get something that'll be really, really good. Um, hmm, not a good spawn. Not a good spawn. It's kind of far. We're still going to make a run for it, though. There's typically somebody that spawns like right over here. They should have been running up this ramp already though. So I find that kind of odd. Hmm. It's a scav. We're just gonna run away from the scav. I can literally get one tapped right now by most stuff. Thought I heard a footstep over there. Okay. This might be a really bad idea with how weak I am. No risk, no reward, right? I'm 
No risk, no reward. How many times did I shoot this guy? He just hatcheted me to death. Top of the head. Bro. Hit count. I hit that guy eight times. So 35 damage would have hit the first guy. And so that's 300 and what? 323? He's fucking hurt so bad. Jeez Louise. He was just farming the ultra medical room. I knew I had such a bad spawn for that. That's eh, awful. All right, so we are really hurt. Hmm. With that spawn, I shouldn't have done that. I knew that was kind of a bad idea. Um, I do have this SKS and all this PS ammo, so I think that's the play. Just kind of want this to unload this into. Maybe I gotta uh, do all this first though. It's actually suppressed too, so that's kind of nice. This might not be terrible. Um, I don't, I don't. You want to know what? Mm, uh, <laughs> we're gonna take a bandage. I just don't have anything to heal. I can't trade for any healing either, can I? I need a paid. Or what, white duct tape. That's for money. I can't buy that. Okay. Um, I can actually. Let me just do this really quick. Get rid of this. Clear up some space. Um. We'll just put those in there too. So we're gonna go four and five. All right. Since we're hurt. Hmm. I don't know where to go right now. Like every map seems like a terrible idea to do it. Uh, <laughs> we could run interchange again. Interchange is just gonna be hard. Customs is probably gonna be hard. Factory might be doable. Let's just try it. Why not? Why not? I wonder if anybody's keeping count to how often I get that shit spawn that's cornered way in the back. It's gotta be at least 50%, bare minimum. We didn't get it that time. We're actually on the other side of it though. We're gonna run away from it. So there is somebody somewhere, not too far away, that just killed the scav. It's actually pretty loud. Come on. He's going up top. Hmm. 
think he's up top. No. Sounds like he's on this side now. Somebody on the glass right next to me. Might have just ran off. What's up, Tot? Checking doors? Willing to bet somebody died right there. Too quiet to still have somebody alive. Definitely sounded like like a suppressed uh, submachine gun though. I think I do still hear two sets of footprints though. Still doors opening above me. Glass either coming down or going up. Come on, open the door. Come on! He just left. He's listening to. There's a guy above me too. There, it's got to be a two-man team. Got him in the arm. I knew that he was just that guy was gonna be waiting on me. Head jaws, dude. I would have won by, been one tap by that scab by like anything. Like I, I would have had to have had a, a face shield on no matter what. Man, that's a bummer.
Damage absorbed by armor. I, I just hit PS ammo. I hit twice? Only with one bullet? Had to have fragmented then. Yeah, I mean, oh, that's, that's actually a lot of damage for, uh, yeah, one shot PS ammo. Jeez Louise, dude. Previous damage is a killer right now. <laughs> oh, man. We're in a rough spot. We are. We're we're on a losing streak for sure. Hmm. We need a good win. Do I really have anything that could get me a good win? Not really. This is all I can really do. Um... I had a snipe somewhere. I need something to eat or drink probably too. Yeah. Um, do I have anything that does bull? Nope. Nothing like that at all. Let's put this so we can cover my white ass head. Oh, we do have some. We're just gonna use all of that right now. <laughs> we need that big time. Um, So we don't have anything to eat or drink. I'm going to go shoreline and take it really slow. I'm gonna have to find some food and water along the way. It's just gonna have to happen. All right, so we don't really have much going on here for us right now. So we gotta take this super, super slow. Uh, we're avoiding the resort. And this is actually the side I didn't wanna spawn on. That was lagged. We got a laggy server? Oh, man. That probably could have killed me. Let's be honest. So sometimes you will see somebody run up here. Maybe we can get lucky with our TKM FMJ butthole ammo. Nah, we'll give it another 20 seconds. Okie doke. Didn't see anybody there. There is a stash up here that if uh, nobody else can hit it, I will gladly hit it. Because we are in need of some stuff. Man, server's super laggy. That's not good. That's actually a Salua, and I can't take it. It's super sad. Super duper sad. I feel like going up on weather station is probably a bad idea. We definitely want to take the path less traveled. I 
it's a lot of landscape over here so let's just get a idea of the lay of the land obviously we couldn't see this before super froggy All right, let's get down in between here As always, trying to stay in the middle. I definitely made some noise there, though. This is a very, not very well traveled area, though. So we should be all right for the most part. Get up on this hill a little bit, see if we can get a peek around. I haven't heard a single gunshot. Not a single gunshot. Five minutes into the raid. Makes me think that there's probably a large group that spawned on this side. They could have went to resort. I mean, it very well could be a thing. That's more than one person throwing grenades. One person wouldn't be able to throw them that fast. So we're going to go check this cache down here really quick. I think we might be all right to head up to a uh, weather station. Good. We need ammo more than anything. We need something that we can shoot out of the gun. We also need a backpack really bad. There's definitely somebody up there. I didn't know. Man, I could have shot that guy. What was he doing? I didn't know if that was a guy or what. I honestly thought that was like a... Is that a scav? Scavs go inside of there now? There he is. Why am I all over the place? I can't shoot right now. It's going, it's going everywhere. I was... I was holding breath and everything. I just let my stamina get down too low. I'm gonna have to re-aim. I think that's a scav though. It's gotta be a scav. The Yushanka, everything, I mean it all points to being a scav. There he is.
He dead? It went through the window, so that's a good sign. I think we just sit here for a minute just to confirm the kill. Because if he ain't dead, we might be in trouble. That might be it, dude. The body might have fallen over just because I didn't see anything like that right, right before. All right, I think we're all right. Let's go. Why does your body armor have nothing? Pro. How is that a thing? Even? Give me all you got. Hmm. We're full. It's just a regular old scab staying in here. That means nobody came in here yet, I'm assuming. I think I'm right. I think that... Oh, went out of there. I think that uh, there was a large group that spawned on this side. And they must have went to resort. It's the only, only possible way. Definitely need that. It's power supply there, and I can't take it. Can I? No. Find out what's in here, though. Rubles and rubles. Finding a GPU in here is like almost never happens. Oh, we searched all of those. You might as well search this one too. That's actually big. We need that. Measuring tape? We are going to really need that actually too i think i have one we need quite a few toolkits so we're gonna have to trade for them all another tape okay med bag nice what's in here Ibuprofen and a Salua. All right. So we want the Ibuprofen for sure. We definitely need the Salua. So what are we getting rid of? We'll get rid of those, I think. That's the best way. And we're for that. We'll five that. Uh, we want four or five, six. That's what we want. More sugar. It's Tashanka. What do I need? I need energy. Cool. Yeah, I'm gonna eat that Tishanka, I think. Alright, whatever. I'm just gonna eat it out of there, so it'll be fine. We ain't keeping it there. Chill. Chill. Not a big deal.
I really don't need this mask either. It's kind of nice to have them, though. Alright, we don't need that. Okay. So we do need this Lua for a quest, too. So that's going to be super helpful there. I did not shoot that guy in the chest at all, and he has point five on his packa. <laughs> God, super annoying. All right, there is just a ton going on at the resort right now. So as long as we don't go to the resort, I think we're fine. Wonder if Sniper Scab is still there. If Sniper Scab is still here, it'd be wild. So he doesn't look to be there. Kind of worries me about going there now. Shoot. Alright, so that sounded like it was over there. I just want to sit here for a minute. Just double check. Really, bro. I really want Sniper Scab to still be alive. Just to give me the key that it's good to go in there. It's not good to go in there. Alright, we're gonna have to back up. There was that paid that could get me another Salua too. I'm gonna need to go back and get that. That's a quest item. Pull this 8R back out. I always think it's funny when you have the sight on the 8R and the iron sights, but obviously it's the gas block. I don't know, it's just, it's just in the way. This is goofy looking. Is that a body? That's no, a rock. Okay. We're just doubling back. We're going to need to go up kind of the resort way anyways. To avoid... It's just such a pinch point going to the electrical uh, power station. And I heard shots over by gas station. That's a pinch point too. Now there is a ton of noise going on over at resort. But I still think it's our safest bet. Because I think it's just going to depend on the pathing we take more than anything. Alright, so from here. Alright, so we can drop this. We'll drop that. We need that. Do I need this? I feel like I need this for something. Ah, it'll be alright. Because the resort, I mean, the people should be inside the resort fighting by now. 
so it shouldn't be a big deal. But me with my useless pack armor. I, I essentially, I have no armor. So Steam Audio does a really good job. So basically the way it used to be for, before is it sounded like everything on you is actually on you. But now you can hear stuff jingling on your sides and stuff that's on you still. It throws me off all the time. Like when you're searching, you know, it it doesn't sound like you're searching inside of your head. Like it sounds like you're actually searching right there, you know? Man, it's it's hard to tell sometimes if it's like you think you hear something. Is the Salua have to be found in raid? I don't think it does. I don't think it has to be found in a raid. All right, so we're 30 minutes down. Hydration's a little bit low. Big thing is, I mean, we did get a Salua out of this. We were able to heal up. I think that was the most important part about all of this. I mean, technically we have two Saluas right now. I still can't believe I got hatcheted in Ultra. Such a bummer. Literally gave me such a trash spawn for it, too. Could be something to drink in here. I'm debating on whether I risk it to go. To resort. I don't really think it's worth it. I mean, it could really, really be worth it. Just picking up the scraps. Because all the fighting there is over, you know? <laughs> oh, shit. Absolutely wrecked. Man. Huh. And I was way out in the middle of nowhere, too. M61. I hope you have fun with that VPO. The funny thing is, is like, they're going to be like, man, this guy definitely looks like he was a scab, but like, <laughs> definitely wasn't. Um, man, that was a rough, that was a rough go right there, but it happens. It happens from time to time. We, we've actually had a pretty freaking rough episode. Um, we're going to, we're going to have to wrap up this episode here, man. That is, that was just, that was bad. Like, what are they doing back there? Like, why are you back there? A two-man way back there? There's literally no point of being back there. And I'm always super sus of Shoreline to begin with. I don't know. It happens. But, all right, guys. Thanks for hanging out. I uh, hope you liked the next episode. And, um, you know, episode number, what was it, five? 
This is episode number five, yeah. So I hope you enjoyed episode number five. Uh, we are going to be recording episode six here soon. I'm not going to do it tonight. Just because that one just... That episode was just bad. Sometimes with this game, you just got to take a step away. Come back to it. So I think that's what we're going to do. Uh, but we're going to call it there. So thanks for hanging out. Make sure to click the subscribe button if you're not subscribed. So in that way, you can get notifications whenever the new videos come out. Uh, so you can keep up to date and not miss any episode in the series. Also, if you could do me a favor and click the like button, it helps out a ton. Uh, definitely with the YouTube algorithm and such. Uh, being a smaller content creator, you know, I, I definitely appreciate it. Every like I get. So, uh, cool. And uh, we'll see you in the next episode. Have a good day.